2006 is already shaping up to be an amazing year for Gaga and without further ado, here is another episode of Lady Gaga LG5 News and Rumours. Quite a few bits and pieces have happened since my last LG5 News and Rumours so I'm going to keep it short and snappy and here we go. Item number one, Lady Gaga won the Golden Globe for her role as the Countess in American Horror Story and what an amazing night it was. She'd done a really heartfelt speech and it kind of solidified her little role as an actress. I think she did an amazing job as the Countess. I think she's really good at playing characters anyway because she's already explained that playing the role of Lady Gaga is something that she's been doing for a very long time and so to play the Countess, something totally new, was a big challenge for her and she nailed it and she won the Golden Globe. She looked absolutely stunning in that black dress and it was a really successful evening for her. Item number two, on the same night on the interview after the award show, she actually did announce that she is going to be releasing new music this year. She didn't give us a date, she didn't give us an album title, but we do know we are going to be getting music this year. If I have to put a bet on it myself, I would say it's going to be at the later end of the year, around October, November. It wouldn't surprise me because knowing Gaga, she does do the, the these few months running up to it have always been her key months of like creativity when creating her music. So I personally think she's going to be doing it at the end of the year, don't quote me on that. But yeah, pretty exciting news, music this year. Number three, Lady Gaga was nominated for an Oscar for Best Original Song with Till It Happens To You and what an achievement this is. Gaga released this statement via Instagram in a typewriter style feel, thanking the Academy for acknowledging the song and saying how much the song means to her. And I'm really, really proud of her. An Oscar nomination is a big deal. Um, I really, really personally think she's going to win it because the song is so meaningful, but she's up against Sam Smith with his James Bond song writing on the wall, so I guess we'll see, but fingers crossed, she wins. And finally, a little rumour floating around there, we were all met with the really tragic news that one of Gaga's idols, David Bowie, did pass away this week. And it's really sad news, a lot of celebrities have showed their love, um, but... Surprisingly, Gaga has remained absolutely silent about this matter. She's only retweeted one fan who tweeted something about Gaga and Bowie, but she hasn't actually said anything from herself. And the big rumour floating around out there is that she is set to do a performance at the Grammys, and the rumour is that she's going to be doing a big tribute set to David Bowie. It wouldn't surprise me, I don't think Gaga is the kind of artist who's going to absolutely say nothing on the subject, because at the beginning of her career she was so heavily influenced by David Bowie, she she said multiple times in interviews that she, he is one of her biggest idols and to be honest I think she's got something planned to celebrate the death of David Bowie. We were already told that she was doing a performance at the Grammys but it wasn't going to be any new music so I think this kind of would fit in whatever plan she kind of did have before David Bowie's death I do think she'll do something to weave in a bit of a, a tribute to him. That is the updated Lady Gaga LG5 news and rumours. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments what you think of new music this year from Gaga and when do you think it's going to be released. Do you agree with me that it's the end of the year? And I will see you guys in my next LG5 news and rumours video. Bye!